Now, we'll create some role-based authorized views. So, open home folder and create an empty razor view named admin. Inside it, create code block and set page title. Then create div tag. Inside it, create heading tag for admin. Now, create another empty razor view named user. Copy the code from admin page and paste in user page. Change the page title and heading to user. Now, open home controller. On top of privacy action, add authorized annotation to restrict its access to logged in persons only. Then create a new action named admin. Inside it, return view. At top of it, add authorized annotation and use roles property and pass admin role in string format. Now this action is only accessible to admin role. Now copy this action and paste below. Change action name to user and also change role to user. Now open layout page. In navigation, add if statement to check user role by using user.isInRole method and pass admin role to it. Inside it, add list item and anchor tag to redirect to admin page. This list item will only be shown people with admin role. Then add another if statement to check the user role. Inside it, add anchor tag to redirect to user page. Now run the app. Try to open privacy page. We are redirected to login page because privacy page is an authorized view. Now login as user. Open the privacy page again. Now we are able to access it. As we logged in as user, we are able to see the user page but not admin page. Open this page. There's an error. Open the layout page. We have misspelled the user action. Hot reload the app. Change URL to user page. Now we are able to see the user's page. Now log out and try to sign in as admin. Copy the admin's password from the seed service class. Now, admin page is shown here instead of user because we logged in as an admin now. Open privacy page. We can see this page. Open admin page. We are also able to access this page. With this, this tutorial is complete. I hope you liked it. If you have any question, feel free to ask it in the comment section. And finally, thanks for watching. See you in next video.